Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to the fire station. The firefighters are going to show you the fire station inside and out. They're going to show you the kitchen. They're going to show you where they sleep. They're going to show you the trucks. But first, you must put on your listening ears so they can hear the fire radio. The fire radio tells them where to go to calls. So everybody, let's be quiet and listen to what we have to say. First, we're going to talk about fire safety. The first thing we want to talk about is the meeting place. The meeting place is a location in your yard where you live. If the smoke detector beeps, you want to go to a location like the mailbox, your neighbor's house, or even a car, and the family will meet there. The family should pick a meeting place together. You must choose a place that is safe and everyone in the family knows the location. Once you are outside the house, stay outside. Never go back in to get a favorite toy, your pet, or look for other people. They may already be outside and walking to the meeting place. You can also go to a neighbor's house to call 911. A neighbor's house can keep you warm in the winter while you wait for the firefighters to arrive. Always keep your toys put away so at night you do not trip over these things when you're going to your meeting place. Now we're in the kitchen. The kitchen is where we prepare food and eat it. But only adults should be in the kitchen when they're cooking. You stay out because the stove is hot. Never go near the stove when adults are cooking. This is what you see on the stove. This is what an adult sees. Also in the kitchen are chemicals underneath the sink. These chemicals are dangerous. These chemicals are not safe for kids to play with. No, they are not. Make sure adults put a safety latch on these cabinet doors to keep them away from your little brothers and sisters. Keep your pets out of the kitchen also. Adults could trip and fall while they are cooking. If you see paper towels near the stove, tell an adult to move them away from the heat. Why? Because it could catch on fire. You also want to keep your toys out of the kitchen as well. This is the living room. Look, in the living room, there's a fireplace. The fireplace is hot. You should never play around the fireplace. Sometimes when wood logs burn, they pop and the hot sparks will jump out onto the carpet or rugs. You should never have a rug in front of the fireplace. And you should make sure an adult puts a screen in front of the fireplace. Is that hot chocolate or hot coffee in the cup? If this spilled on your skin, you would get burned. So you should always be careful when you see hot coffee or hot chocolate. Cigarettes are hot. So are matches and lighters. Never play with matches or lighters. If you see matches or lighters or a hot cigarette, Tell an adult to put them away and out of the reach of small children. This is called a space heater. It too can get very hot. Never play around or touch a space heater. This is a candle. They are pretty but hot. Never play with candles. Never touch candles. The fire can burn you. This is the bedroom. In the bedroom is a smoke detector. This is what the smoke detector sounds like. If you hear that sound, you should crawl to the door, test the door with the back of your hand. If the door is cool and it is safe to go out the door, Get outside and meet the family at the meeting spot. If the door is really, really hot, you must go to a window and wait for help. A window is important. It can be used as a second way to get out of your bedroom. Never jump from the window. Wait for someone to help you or bring you a ladder. 
A neighbor may help you, or a family member, or a firefighter may help you get out. If you are on the second floor, you may want to use an escape ladder. Never hide in a closet or under a bed. This is the hallway and bathroom. You should always take your toys and put them away and leave all the clutter out of the hallway. Look at all the things plugged into the electrical socket. This is unsafe. It may overload the electrical socket and start a fire. Tell an adult to unplug some of the wires and do not overload the electrical socket. This is the fire station. Look at all the fire coats, fire pants, and fire boots. Firefighters wear these heavy coats to keep them from getting burned. You do not have this gear, so it is important that you get out of the house when you smell smoke or hear the smoke detector. The firefighters will now take you on a tour of their fire station. They will show you all kinds of tools like the ladders, their special hats called helmets, flashlights, they will show you fire gloves, a fire extinguisher. A fire extinguisher is used for small fires. So what did we learn today? We learned that the kitchen is dangerous sometimes and the stove is hot. The fireplace can be hot. You also want an adult to test your smoke detector every month. So put on your listening ears. The firefighters are going to show you their fire station. Thank you for watching.